This is the Military and Aerospace Electronics Report. I'm John Keller. I'm noticing some very interesting defense work on fundamental improvements to phased array radar that has the potential for big payoffs in the size, range, and sensitivity of future radar systems and even may lead to covert surveillance sensors that previously were limited only to the electro-optical domain. Now, earlier this month, the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, or DARPA, gave the go-ahead to Teledyne Scientific and Imaging in Thousand Oaks, California, to move into the advanced stages of a microelectronics program that ultimately may create the ability to fabricate phased array radar transmit and receive modules on a wafer, much the same way that companies fabricate integrated circuits on wafers. Now this program is called Scalable Millimeter Wave Architectures for Reconfigurable Transceivers, or SMART for short, which Teledyne has been working on for several years. Now, in the Phase 3B part of the program, Teledyne scientists are attempting to create deployable SMART technologies for future military radar and communication systems. Teledyne now is trying to create high-yield smart components at advanced technology red readiness levels and move smart technology to batch fabrication for a military application that requires millimeter wave capability. Now the smart program essentially seeks to develop wafer scale integration for RF and microwave transmit receive modules and is trying to develop three-dimensional mimic chips that can fit small power amplifiers between transmit receive nodes in a phased array antenna. This is to enhance the efficiency and sensitivity of radar and communication systems. And so far, Teledyne engineers have developed 44 gigahertz transmit subarrays and has demonstrated a millimeter wave tiled array by inventing a way to integrate silicon digital beam forming and compound indium phosphide power amplifier mimics. And if that weren't enough, there's more radar technology in the news. The Air Force this month revealed a program called Phased Array Antenna for Passive RF Sensing, which might lead to covert passive radar surveillance capability for ground sites and for aircraft. Covert radar surveillance is a bigger deal than it might sound. A radar, by its nature, transmits radio waves, which alerts anyone nearby to its presence. Turning on a radar is kind of like sweeping a flashlight around a darkened room. You might find what you're looking for, but everyone knows you're there. Now, the Air Force Research Lab at Wright-Patterson Air Force Base in Ohio is asking industry to develop revolutionary new wideband dual polarized phased array antenna technologies for this program, which seeks to develop analog and digital beam forming techniques that could provide as many as 64 independent beams simultaneously. Now that means the kind of radar technology the Air Force envisions might, at worst, prevent an adversary from pinpointing the, radar, the radar's transmitter. At best, though, it might develop a radar with a signal that essentially hides in the RF noise without tipping off an adversary that is being watched. So next time you think of radar as old mundane technology, think again. Today's research is liable to take radar a lot further forward. For the Military and Aerospace Electronics Report, I'm John Keller.